there's flowers there I couldn't even name only the eucalyptus right so we won't go there welcome to Sunday and welcome to my shave den bathroom no it's not man cave that's a bit of a beer thing I think anyway welcome to the shave going to use a a razor I like quite quite a lot, uh, relatively new um, to my collection, uh, and I had this through Steve, Stephen Scott, thank you Stephen, um, hope you're both well, and that's this thing, the Wilkinson Sword, you can see there, flip top, quite a rare razor, there you go, you press that button there, I've used it before, um, that's what it looks like, non-adjustable, so we're going to use that, with a Persona Platinum. And I'm just gonna talk about, you know when I say about these, and people say these are very rare to get hold of, or harder to get hold of. I think you, you still buy them, but um, not as sort of, how can I say, um, available as they used to be, maybe. Uh, Persona Platinum, right? Persona Red. So look for them, Persona Platinum. It's the same, same thing uh, as far as i've used them for many years one of my favorite blades and i can't tell the difference between them so i would say if you can't get the red go for them and we'll use one of these today so uh, if you've ever wanted to try the red you know god it's warm in here like summer okay so that's going to be that the soap lovely i love this stuff sterling British leather, beautiful sort of leathery. If you're from the UK, I've said it before, if you like imperial leather soap, the old soap, this is it. Lovely stuff, really nice. My father used to shave with imperial, if we had one, used to lather up off the soap. Because as I say, them days, it wasn't, uh, it wasn't enjoyed, there was not, we didn't have the, um, the amount, the quantity, the artisans as there is today, or the interest in it. It was just a, a chore that mended, uh, but it so happened that the razors they had then were so good quality, which they wouldn't have realised at the time. Um, they worked, they lasted, and they were cheaper to buy. You could, you know, you could buy a Gillette for five pounds or something like that. <laughs> You know, or less than that, probably. Um, right, talking of brushes, we're going to use AP Shave Company. It's just soaking in some uh, hot water. What this is, I'll just shake it out for you to see. This is a gold and ivory, or ivory and gold handle with a flex of gold in there. Beautiful. If the light catches that right, it's nice. And this is a Badger brush, 24 millimeter. Um, SHD, super high density, which means there's a lot of hair crammed in there, and it is very, very dense. Uh, really nice brush. That's been soaking for about five minutes in the hot water there. Well, tap hot water. And um, it's the knot itself on their website called the Jealousy Knot. Uh, really nice. So we're going to use that as AP. So we're going to use that. Just put it back in there for a minute. And, we'll start to, and I've put, I'm using the um, fine bowl and I've just spread a sort of a thumbnail in and it should be fine. So we'll start to create a lather. So it is moist and we can add water. Not forgetting we're using a badger. But I want to collect all that soap. There you go. Oh, it's a gorgeous scent. Dip the water. So, are we partaking in the shave today? Or this weekend? I hope you're having a nice weekend, by the way. Whenever you are in the world, whatever you're doing. Nice and safe and happy, hopefully. And healthy, that's the main thing, isn't it? And just to top it off, some nice shaves if you're having one. Yeah. Well, we're certainly having one here. And something a bit different for, for lunch today. His Lordship would not approve, would you, sir? No! no. 
Not eating that. <laughs> What's here? <laughs> Not eating that foreign muck or whatever it is. Spice doesn't like anything too spicy. Right, that there is, uh, I would say, just right for me. Yeah, that's good enough. That's lovely. Okay, to wet this old. Uh, this old mug of mine. And we'll get going. Here we go. Happy Sunday to you. That's lovely. Not an aggressive razor, this. Um, just the standard sort of like the uh, Wilkinson sort of classics, really. So we'll take the blade out we place it carefully on there and then you flip simple as that really nice okay oh, I must do you ever forget uh, if you soak a brush I forget to empty this sometimes I'm quite good lately but it does happen. So here we go. It does really spread out. See how it's um, so it's so dense. It's soap as it's gathered has sort of spread the splay the brush. Oh, and it's soft. No scratchiness at all. Do you know this is like a leathery soap, but there's a... It reminds me, somehow, of Old Spice. It's that type of... You know, that type of scent. Or what I should say, really. If you like Old Spice, you'd like this. Probably. But you know, these are my opinions, my own tastes, really, if you like. And as I said many times, your mileage may vary. We're all different. So here we go, that's heated up. Here we go, the Wilkinson Sword Flip Top. Persona Platinum from the Blue Pack. Yeah, that's nice. That's the angle. Where's that spot gone? So it's a mild shave, but it's really does its job. Doesn't affect the cutting edge, should we say? So, any plans this weekend? Or how, have you done anything Saturday? Have you started something you wish you hadn't? That can happen, can you? You start a job, but you think, oh, well, yeah, do that. And it turns into a big job. <laughs> and then it turns into a nightmare. And you think, oh, I wish I hadn't started it. Yeah, very mild razor. As I say, it's a, it's a slick soap as well, so but as you can hear, it's cutting straight through. I like this razor. As I say, I'm lucky to have this really because Stephen spotted it and asked me, he said, do you want one? So I bought it off him and well, he sort of bought it for me and then I sent him the money over, you know, for, so it's part of my collection now. Lucky enough. Thank you, Stephen. 
warm. Put a cup of touch. A few drips. Mm -hmm. Another scent my father would approve of. And it's funny, you know, you think to yourself, well, how do I know what scents he would like? Because we never spoke about it. And the reason is, is because of my memory of scents I could smell as he shaved. And it was always the same classic scents. And in this type of scent, you know, the, he liked the... the uh, Musks and the woods, spice, old spice. We're going across the growth now. So you have to rinse this regular, especially for the soap is a slick one. So I did, um, I got some ribs, short ribs left. Um, Cause I got a good few of them. And in a sort of a sauce, marinated, you know, little short ribs. And what I'm gonna do, I got about eight of them, I think. No, it's more than that. 10, could be 12, or 10 or 12, sort of, does it matter? Anyway, spare ones, so I'm gonna strip them off the bone, pull them off the bone, so it's like a pull, I'm gonna make a pulled pork, so it'll all be chopped up. Um, and I've added to the marinade a hot chili powder, because I like hot things spicy. Um, so they'll have a kick to them. And all I'm going to do, it's quite a simple meal, I'm going to, as I say, pull the pork off, chop it all up, put it in a tortilla wrap with lettuce, red onion, the pork, a bit of mayonnaise, garlic mayo, I think, and um, wrap it up. Oh no, sorry, some chilli sauce on top of the on top of that, some chilli sauce, and then wrap them up. I got I I think I'll be able to make sort of three good ones. Um and I'll have them with a maybe a bit of a salad type side, tomatoes and cucumbers, some of like that. See how it goes. Potato salad. Or I'll go the other way and I'll have a some spare sort of chips as we call them um, steak what do you call them in the states people do tell me if i get like thicker chips fries but they're thicker right third application so it'd be a simple simple meal This feels so soft. Beautiful. What's that? But very tasty. What's on your meal? What's your meal of the day? Shave of the day, meal of the day, please. Against the growth.
Yeah, I can't tell any difference between this and the red. If that helps anybody. If you ever wondered if there was a difference. There could be a difference, but I can't tell at all. Same brand. Same name. I think they've just sort of re sort of packaged them. Maybe. Dog outside agrees. Very, very slick, very slick. That is good. That is nice. You know what time it is now? <laughs> Three, two, one. Pick up time, baby. Yeah. All right. Won't be in work today. Why not? I'm still suffering from Friday's St. Patrick Day celebrations. I spot a bit of claret there. Are these reopeners from the Mule La 41? Most of these nicks, you know, my own fault for going, I just go over and over. And... But I like that sort of... I'd rather that. Listen to this. That's what I keep looking for. To hear that sound. along with that. Right, cold water rinse. Oh, that's nice. That is nice. Right. Come on. I'll never make you good looking, but you'll feel like a million bucks, baby. <laughs> right, I'm going to use a bit mentholated witch hazel, homemade. Determined to get to the determined to get to the bottom of this. And it's not a strong menthol; it's just a hint. Which is lovely. And then, of course, we've got the matching splash, the uh, sterling uh, British leather 
after shave splash. Oh, go on. Show it some. Don't be hand up. There you go. Don't say, don't give me nothing. Mm. Hey. Oh, nice. No burn either, no sting. Which is, uh, which is good. Oh, I don't mind a bit of a sting. It's, uh, especially if you cut yourself. This stuff is good. Uh, I use this quite a bit. It's the Gab Gabri Aftershave Cream Cologne. It goes well. Any This goes well with any sort of classic, woody, musty, um, leathery scent, in my opinion. There you go. A little dab will do you. That's a nice pick up. Pick me up scent. Cologne sort of scented cream. And that is beautiful. So there we go. So we've used this, as I say, quite a rare razor. You don't see many of them, do you? Or being used. Anyway, um, it's the Wilkinson Sword Flip Top Razor. Non-adjustable. Mild. Um, but very, very, very... Uh, very good, even with slick soap, it cuts. Just takes a bit longer when it's milder. But uh, really nice. We've used the British leather, sterling British leather shaving soap. Good stuff. Very slick. Gorgeous scent. Um, imperial leather scent. It reminds me down the road, as I said, of this old spice, in a way. Uh, really nice. And then we've used the AP Shave Company Ivory and Gold Handle Brush with a Jealousy super high density 24 millimeter badger brush or badger knot the fine accoutrements lather ball and um, we've used a brand new persona platinum from the blue tuck really nice as i say i can't tell the difference between them and the red homemade mentholated witch hazel sterling british leather aftershave splash gorgeous stuff and then finished off and uh, protected ourselves with a bit of Gabri um, aftershave cologne or cream cologne, aftershave cream cologne. And that's it. I'll leave you to it. Enjoy your shave if you're having one. Have a great weekend. Thanks for everything. Thanks for being there. Thanks for your time and your patience. <laughs> and um, yeah, have a great weekend. Look after yourselves. Take care. And I'll see you on Wednesday for the midweek shave. All the best. And bye-bye.